I will say I like for me, and I've heard Dave Ramsey say this too, like if you want to touch or strike a man's ego or his spirit, talk about his finances. Mm -hmm. And for me, like I've always been really frugal and I've always wanted to make sure that my finances were in order. And I felt good about that just for my own security. And beforehand, like I was crushed, especially when we started the, the MBA program. I felt good about the revenue, but I didn't really understand that, oh, you've got to, you have to start over from ground zero because I really had to start over with the books because things weren't in line. So I really was stressed because I felt like it was taking away from the time of actually growing and getting more sales. And it was backtracking, which I didn't like and I didn't have time for. I didn't want to spend time on so that was stressful, just in demoralizing, honestly, to have to go back track like I felt like I did. So when I when I did meet you and then when we did start working together and started working through these things, I slowly but gradually, I'll be honest, I had hope. Like as soon as we started, I had hope because I knew that one day I wasn't going to have to actually worry about this as much and it was going to be a process. But when it was finished, I was going to feel really good, really, really good. Uh, and I, I guess I can fast forward to when I realized like, oh my gosh, like, of course with the NBA, but with you, I wouldn't have been able to know the financial health of the business. And I wouldn't have been able to know that, hey, we increased the net profit 100%, 120%. And I wouldn't have these, these metrics to be able to look at to actually have honest conversations with my fiance right now. Like, hey, here's what's in the bank. Here's how much we need if we want to do this thing full time together. It's just, I have this stuff set up now to where honestly i can go on with my life and be accurate with with the numbers and speak that language that's help that helps us uh, set up our career and i'm super thankful to you for because i try to think about what it would be like if i didn't have this set up and i would be operating in the dark i would not have an honest assessment on where the business was or is and honestly i would just be playing games running around in circles so a huge stress reliever um well, honestly, I couldn't operate a business without it, without you doing what you've done and your consistent help. And even even now, like uh, more more tax liability, more taxes than I've ever had to pay. And it kind of like, ooh, it kind of threw me aback. And the CPA said, you need to find some more expenses. And I dug and I tried to find it and I found some, but even just like a recent example, this is like last week, two weeks ago, <laughs> I was stressed out about that because of how much time it literally takes to get these things in line and to make sure that they're accurate. So you're not paying more in taxes than you need to and getting in trouble with the IRS, which nobody wants to do. So you just, you came through really quickly, honestly, and you, you made it a priority, which I really do appreciate and turned it around really fast to make sure that honestly, you saved me a, 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 a a big tax break, like a significant tax break by finding those expenses and then making them accurate in my books. And I can go on and on, but the biggest thing is a huge stress. You are a huge stress reliever. I do have peace with the finances. I like going into my books now. I love going into them and seeing the profit and loss statement, the balance sheet, the cash flow statement, and knowing that is actually accurate and having an a accurate picture of the health of my business. So uh, if that don't answer the question, I apologize, but it's a huge stress reliever. You have been a huge blessing to me and will continue to be one, I know. So thank you for, for what you do.